We are looking now at a lot of 10 early 19th century engraved plates or prints um, done by men who worked at the United States Mint as engravers. This first one here is Christian Gobrecht, as is this one. He was one of the chief engravers at the U.S. Mint. And here is another Gobrecht. And here is a Gobrecht. And this one is a Gobrecht, as is this one. Now we have a James Longacre. And what's interesting about the Longacre is that <clears throat> they clearly must have been done separately uh, with papers sent to him because each time we encounter a Longacre engraving from this vintage, the paper has uniformly browned like this on it. In fact, we have, waiting in the wings, another example of this one pl uh, image right here. And it is identical in its toning, and it came from an entirely different source at a different time. So th this uh, paper quality is almost certainly a function of the paper being used, not the way that it was stored or any fault of a, a previous owners. It's just what has happened to the paper due to the composition when it was originally made. But nonetheless, these are Longacre engravings, and he was uh, another one of the uh, major chief engravers at the U.S. Mint. And then these two are by Young and Delacre. They were engravers uh, in involved with banknote printing. And so this lot of 10, circa 1819, 1820 engraved images, is available online from me, Brian DeMambro.